Uh, this uh, is another uh, instrument that uh, Will's got for sale. Uh, it also was uh, handmade by uh, Oral Henderson in 1994 here in Elkview, West Virginia. Uh, Elkview up in the mountains, West Virginia, has got uh, certainly a good area for violin making. It's uh, out in the way out in the woods there. A lot of uh, some pretty scenery up in Elkview. I've been up in there. Uh, this violin right here. Uh, honest opinion, Will wanted me to give you my opinion because I know a little bit about violins. Uh, this violin is, uh, to look at it, uh, it, it doesn't, the sound does not, uh, uh, you know, match, seem like match the uh, appearance. I mean, it's a beautiful violin. It just doesn't, the top to me it is not as, I, I like a darker violin. It's, it's, a, it's whatever your taste in the instruments. This is a lighter top, but what I'm really impressed by, it's got a three-piece back. It's very beautiful. I'll just see if you can get a shot of that back. It's very beautiful back. Uh, some real pretty maple in, in the uh, back and the neck. Uh, but what impressed me the most about this instrument is the tone. I couldn't believe that the tone... <laughs> Challenge. I mean, it, it, it's you can hear it's very loud, and uh, it's got a good, nice, woody melatonin. Uh, I think he's wanting two thousand dollars for this one, and I I would recommend it. Thank uh, you, Jeff. I think, uh, I think it's very, very much worth that. So. Thank you, sir. Contact information on that. My cell phone number: three zero four nine eight nine eight four three two, where my email is fiddlewish at yahoo.com.